you've been working with GraphQL long enough, you'll know the frustration when working with the network tab. As you move around your application and you make more GraphQL requests to your backend, you'll notice in the inspector for the network that you have all of these different GraphQL requests. There's no way to tell from this list of different names, GraphQL, what was going on inside of each request. You can't easily see the requests in any variables and response without going into each request. And then combined with that, you have all of your different pre-flight requests. This is now why you should install the GraphQL Network Inspector from the Chrome Web Store. All you need to do is add this to Chrome, and then inside of the developer tools, you can now navigate to the GraphQL Network tab. Now when you move around your application and you execute different GraphQL operations, now we get a clear list of the operation names for each GraphQL request. We can then see all of the headers, the request, the response, and the raw response. And we can copy any of these values whenever we like. So hopefully you find this tool useful when building GraphQL frontends.